Hey, it's DJ Scream Live. This is Buzzing on the Block. I always chopping it up with the hottest artists in the streets. Fredo Bang is here by heavy request, man. You got a serious fan base, man. I just talked to you about a year ago, but the fans are like, nah, we want to hear them again, damn it. Yeah, 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 yeah. How I feel to have a fan base like that that really ride for you? Oh, uh, it just it just show, show, showing me progress. You know what I'm saying? Showing that my work paying off. Mm-hmm. 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 All right. So Fredo Bang, man. Uh what what you been on, man, during quarantine in this crazy ass twenty twenty? What Fredo been on? Oh uh, no, I really just been recording and trying to finish up this next project and um uh, uh, I've been messing messing with the uh war zone. I've been playing a lot of games. Oh, a lot of games, getting right on the games and shit. You be you be streaming, twitching and shit? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's hard. That's hard. That's hard. So the name of the newest project is Most Hated. You know what I'm saying? Let's talk a little bit about shit, just the vibe of it, the sound of it, and why you decided to name it Most Hated. Uh, Most Hated, really just like on some reverse psychology, because, you know, they say they're going to hate you before they love you. Mm-hmm. So I was like, I'm going to I'm gonna put, I'm going to call it Most Hated, so at the head, it's going to be the most love, you feel me? Mm-hmm. And uh, I really made this tape because I was really holding off on dropping the one that I, I'm about to finish right now. Mm-hmm. So I, I really made this tape my whole month, you know what I'm saying? And it just came out how it was supposed to come out. Dude, that's real, that's real, that's real. And of course, like I said, the fans been saluting you and riding with you and every day. So uh, just knowledge of social media and everything now, is everything cool with Fredo? Because I used to wake up and see Fredo might have, or people might have issues with Fredo and this and all that. Stuff. It seemed like you're on a positive energy vibe and you just trying to make your music. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll be chilling, man. It just, that's like a lot of fan stuff and fan start a lot of stuff, you know what I'm saying? And blogs. Yeah. So, you know, I just, I'm really just focusing on my career and getting money. That's it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Okay, so you're on the music. Saying you playing a little bit of video games. What what other type of shit you on though? Like you 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 active with one female, a few females. You how how you living? Oh, uh, I got one. I got one chick that I'm I'm conversating with. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hopefully it goes somewhere. Okay, that's fair enough. I can deal with that. Yeah. <laughs> I do. <Yeah. laughs> I got. I know. I I can imagine the DMs is crazy, man, and the direct messages, but it. Sometimes, hey, look, most of the billionaires we know got one woman. Just saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so where, where, where are you? You, you still, you still be like Baton Rouge, or have you relocated, or what? Uh, no, nah, I go to Baton Rouge every yeah, month for bro. I, I, I still, I, I legally live there. I just own property inside Miami. Oh, okay. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. What else you been doing during this quarantine outside of video games? Is, is anything you been watching? Uh, like documentaries, movies? Uh, I'll be, uh, be watching a lot of movies. Um, I watched that uh, Tiger King documentary shit. That shit was comedy to me. That shit was funny, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was funny. Yeah. Um, besides that, besides that, I, I, I ain't really so doing you been that. In the kitchen. You been in the kitchen? You said you been cooking? Yeah, my bad, my bad, that was my mom. Are you good? Yeah, I uh, I've been um tightening up my skills in the ki- in the in the kitchen. And, okay. Yeah, yeah. What you be whipping up, man? Um, my little specialty, I got uh some homemade mashed potatoes and some baked chicken, oh, green beans, homemade mashed potatoes, That'd homemade be- from scratch, from scratch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, you getting in there? Yeah, break them down. Yeah, cut the skin off all that shit. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Now, that's all right, bro. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. Listen, man, uh, you know, I've been talking to people from different areas, just trying to, you know, just just get some information, bro, uh, with everything that's going on with the George Floyd incident and, uh, you know, the, uh, the the deaths of black men from police officers, man. First thing I'll ask you is, have you ever had a personal situation that was uncomfortable with police? Uh... Yeah, I have. You have? Yeah, but that's because I was with some niggas that was doing some stupid shit. Like so you admit on your end, we was on some dumb shit. In oh, well, I ain't gonna say we. I was driving. We got pulled over. Supposed to been a a, a broke head, like what well, wasn't. So while well, he get my information, he walked towards the truck. 
Mm-hmm. These dumbass niggas trying to sl- they trying to open the back door and slide the guns under the the, 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 oh, yeah. the uh, under the car. Like oh, it was yeah. the dumbest, it was the dumbest shit. I'm like y'all, like and then they t- they told me like they tell me why we on the ground. Like, I'm like y'all really tried that. That's the dumbest mm-hmm. shit ever. Mm-hmm. And so when he came back to the car, he was just talking like yeah, we hear the other cars pulling up. Like yeah, so what y'all doing? Like, he he just straight pulled out the gun. Hey, all y'all. Don't fucking move. I'll blow all y'all shit off. <laughs> Everybody get the fuck out the car. Oh, boy. I'm like, damn, what the fuck happened? Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, that's, I'll bet that's what I can remember. Other than that, I stay out on people. Hey, I don't fuck with them. They don't fuck with me. <laughs> that's fair enough. That's fair I enough. Just try, I try to keep it like that. So how you feel about it, though, man? I mean, you're still a black man. Of course, you saw the George Floyd, the Amar, the Arbery, man, and then the now – you know, I'm here in Atlanta where they they t- they tearing the city up. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I and, and trust me, I get the passion, I understand the anger and everything, but I just don't. You know I, don't I, I ain't gonna lie, like just this is my opinion. I feel like protesting and shit. Yeah, everything was good until like if, if you gonna loot and set shit on fire, and shit, you need to be setting the police officers on fire. You need to be setting the courthouses on fire. Mm. Stuff that means something to the police and to them. You feel me? Mm. So that the stuff like that make them not setting fucking Target and motherfucking other stores, fucking robbing jewelry stores and boutiques and shit. That shit ain't gonna do nothing because at the end of the day, you really fake. Like when you do that to Target or like to big stores like that, you really, I, I think, I, if I'm not mistaken, you just really give them some, the, the government some money on some shit, I think. Well, it, well, 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 most of them people smart enough to have insurance. So, you know, they gonna sit yeah, at yeah, home yeah, and yeah, you yeah. get a big ass check, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I, I, but I don't, yeah, I don't know how that go, but anyway, yeah, I mean, I mean, if you gonna, if you gonna set shit on fire and fuck over shit, you need to be fuck doing it to the courthouse because at the end of the day, that's gonna make a difference. You set the courthouse on fire, them documents get set on fire, all that evidence room gets set on fire. All the people get free. That's what a lot of people don't know. I had, I had we had an incident like in B- BR. Well, nigga had the plug on the uh, evidence room, and so nigga had a nigga hitting the evidence room, taking all like all the dope out that bitch and serving niggas. You hear me? Mm. So when he went, but when when he went down, and it was time for those, those dudes to go to court, they didn't cop out like just like you know what I'm saying. Well, even the ones that did cop out, like basically. There's no more evidence, so I can just say I never, I never got caught with anything. And now they can't, they can prove, they can't prove that I got caught with anything because they don't have it. Mm. So they free. You feel me? Yeah. So if you want to make a difference, that's what you need to do. But but you ain't here for me though. No, no, no. Yeah, I mean, look, that's my <laughs> perspective, man. I just don't know. Shit, you go steal some Gucci, you gonna be fresh, but I don't know how much that's gonna change. How many times you gonna wear that Gucci? <laughs> I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. We just try to. Yeah, it's just, it's just a sad situation, bro. I, I don't know. I, it's it's a hard video to watch. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Like, yeah, nah. It's it's, it's fucked up, bro. It's fucked up. I yeah, I don't. I, I don't see. I, I, that's why I don't even speak on shit. Like, that, that's, that's fucked up. I can't even. Yeah, it's fucked up. Any way you look at it, it's fucked up, and there's no it is fucked up. Like, can't justify it. And it's fucked up. Yeah, like if you ever, if you ever been in a point to where you couldn't breathe before, just like just being in, in that situation and dying like that, that's a painful death. Yeah. Well, when you calling for your mama that's no longer alive, it got to be painful. That's that's a pain. That's a slow, painful death. Mm-hmm. That's just crazy, man. He, oh, you were calling for his mama. Yeah, I need my mama, but she's mama ain't even. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie, I cut I cut the video off. I didn't want to see them. Yeah, it's tough. No, that's a tough one, and I'm I'm still trying to digest the Ahmaud Arbery shit, which happened right here in Georgia, and I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I, I I did see that. That that was fucked up. Yeah, that's just crazy. Yeah, man, they, they they shot that man with a damn shot, man. Yeah, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. That's, man. I think that's, I think I that's hard though. That's that's some, that's some shit you use to take down bears and shit. Yeah, yeah. Hunt it like hunt it down, man. I think that uh, you know, I don't want to be the 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 optimist to say, hey, you know what I'm saying. But I think that somehow, some way, in some respect, something gonna get a little better. Something gotta give, like something, whatever it is, yeah. like something gotta give, bro. I'm thinking. And I yeah. could be right or wrong. 
You know what I'm saying? No. So what's the first thing you want to do when this quarantine open back up? What's the spot you want to hit? I ain't going to lie. I don't really, I don't really be uh, in the going places unless I'm making some money. Mm -hmm. uh, honestly, but I do. I have been trying to plan a trip to Universal Studios. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Just for the kid and me. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I ain't been in a long ass time. I want to do that again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah. Universal Studios and all Disney, all that shit. I ain't gonna lie. Like Disney trash. I ain't gonna lie. All honest, Disney trash. Ain't shit to do with Disney. You don't like you Disney? Nah, Let but me tell you, hold up. Universal Disney. What's the other one? Nah, I don't fuck with Sea World. Oh, yes. I fuck with Sea World. I've been there too. Sea World, uh, Sea Islands of Adventure. You said what? You talking about Islands of Adventure? And I don't remember, bro. I just be down there just buying the tickets. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the one with like the different. They got the section with the different cultures and shit. Like oh yeah, that. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah. 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 Now it's cool just to have some other shit to do just to get get your mind off all of this shit. That should be cool. Right. Okay. Right. You in the sports? Uh, like as in watching them? Yeah, watching this shit. Not no more. I did too much. Get out of jail. <laughs> <laughs> get too much of that in jail. <laughs> yeah. When I get out of jail, I ain't watching no more of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, like football season, I ain't, I ain't, I was like, damn, the fucking Chiefs and the fucking Quarter Niners in the playoff. I mean, at the finals. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. True story. True story. You got your first plaque yet? I no, I, I'm supposed to have one, but I can't. I can't claim on like twenty five million streams because uh, it's on World Star side. Oh, that's so, up. That don't make it sense. Is, yeah, so I just I gotta I gotta I gotta just re get them. I gotta get them amount of stream most streams on my side. So what what, just, what record was that for? Ooh. Oh yeah 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 okay yeah twenty five. Yeah, that's cool. I, I mean, yeah. they listen. They listen. Give give my man his credit. Right. It's crazy. It's coming though. It's oh, coming. Yeah, I'm just working on. I want to be working on another one to that one. You know, because Ooh's still doing his thing. Like at the end of the day, God bless him. And like, oh, I was about to be two years since it's been out, and it still never lost its stride. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Nah, that's real, man. That's real. So, what can we expect from you the rest of the summer, man? What else, Fredo Bang got up? Fred, Fredo Bang got up his sleeve. I know you said you got one loaded, ready to go. You holding on to it. What else could we yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna release that one like somewhere around like late June, July or something like that. Mm -hmm. and, uh, after that, I'm gonna put another project together before a year end up. Okay, all right. And any any information from that project? Any crazy producers? I know you got to hold the features. Nah. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make you talk about the nah. features. Producers? Nah, nah, nah. nah. Okay, you just want to drop it off. You got to tune in. Just got to tap it. I got you. I got you. All right, well, nah, that's fair enough, bro, man. Salute to you, man. You know you're welcome on the platform anytime, man. Give everybody that Instagram and let them know how to follow me on the gram at F-R-E-D-O-B-A-N-G, F-R-E-D-O-B-A-N-G. Twitter, D-A-Real, F-R-E-D-O-B-A-N-G, D-A-Real, B. I, I started to forget how to spell my guy down there. B-A-N-G. I appreciate you, boo. Nah, it's all good. See you soon. Be safe, bro. Salute. Or.